Good morning guys, it is Hunter here. Welcome back to my channel. So I literally just woke up and it is June 1st and I figured I'm going to film a day in my life. So we're going to get started. I'm going to go ahead and brush my teeth and then we're going to do a little bit of a workout. I'm trying to get onto a workout plan so I'm going to try to do half a mile to a mile on the treadmill. Um, to start out easy since I literally have not worked out in probably two years. So, yeah, I'm excited to bring you guys along with me and let's get into it. Alright, so I've changed into my outfit. This is just a workout set from Amazon, super affordable, and they have lots of colors. Um, so if you're looking for like a cute little workout set or like biker short set, I wear this like even when I'm not working out because um, I told you I don't work out. Um, this is a good option. It's super cute. Then I just have my white hokas and some gray Reebok socks. And yeah, I just do my hair up and we're going to go ahead and head into the treadmill. So... Let's do this. All right, guys, so we are at Petco now. We got little baby Dukers here. We're just letting him go pee before we go in. He's loving it. Scholar's here. We're gonna take him in and get him some treats. We just got some crumble too, so I will show you guys that when we get home and do a little taste test, but. Figured we'd bring him out because he needed a little bit of an adventure. So, yeah, it's a beautiful day out. Pretty hot. And yeah. Alright guys, so I just got back from Walmart and I wanted to do a quick haul to show you guys the stuff that I got to make a quick and easy pasta salad. I love pasta salad in the summer. I think it's so refreshing and just like a yummy snack. So I'll show you guys stuff that I got. Got these mini cucumbers because for some reason I couldn't find the full size cucumbers and then I found them, but I had already put these ones in. So I was like, all right, we'll just do the mini. So you need a cucumber. You can just get one normal size cucumber. Got some full strawberries. These are actually not for the pasta salad, but for my protein smoothies that I'm going to start making for breakfast. So for that then you just need some rotini pasta and you're just going to cook this pasta like the box tells you to got some black olives so these need to be cut in half so we'll have to go ahead and do that a red onion some crumbled feta some cherry tomatoes and then some italian salad dressing so basically you're gonna cook the pasta like it says cut up the um, black olives in half cut up the cucumbers and then you're gonna basically put it all together and you can put it in the fridge or you can eat it right then whatever you wish so yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and make this really quickly and then I will catch up with you guys when I'm done making the pasta salad and I'll show you guys the finished look and I can link the recipe down below. I just found it off Pinterest, but I can link it down below if you guys are interested. So let's go and make it. All right guys, so it is a little bit later. A lot has happened. Basically, as I was making the pasta salad, I was dumping the remains of the onion into the garbage and Duke ended up eating two to three little pieces of chopped onion and I looked it up and like there was this whole thing on dogs getting onion poisoning. They're very toxic for them. Um, and so, yeah, basically sit myself into a whirlwind of anxiety and like panic and we were calling vets. We thought we were going to have to take him to the emergency vet. Like it was a whole stressful time. And so basically two out of the three vets told us to monitor him. If he starts vomiting or diarrhea, call back, take him in immediately, whatever. So, so far he's been okay. It's been probably about an hour um, so basically I have just been, I'm monitoring him for like the rest of the day and yeah, I'm hoping and crossing my fingers that he's going to be okay, but he seems fine right now. He's still in his usual, like upbeat self. So I'm hoping that's a good sign, but 
Oh, so anxious for him right now. But yeah, I made the pasta salad. It was really, really yummy. Besides Duke getting a hold of the onion, but Dookie, it's okay. You get to hang out with Auntie Hunt. And my sister just left, so he is crying now. But yeah, so it was um, crazy. But I also was cooking the pasta salad at the time that they read the verdict for the Johnny Depp Amber Heard trial. Um, so I was really excited to hear that. And of course, throughout the whole trial, I was always team Johnny. Um, just the evidence, if you've looked up, there's so much stuff to support that Amber was lying, was making stuff up. And while there was probably abuse on both sides, I think that this was the correct verdict. And, you know, Johnny won on all of his accounts. So, and that's amazing. But yeah, so I was watching along on some of my, like, lawyers that I watch on TikTok. Because obviously I'm interested in that. I'm going into law school in August myself. So, yeah. I've also just spent some time outside with Duke. We were reading... Or I was reading my book, like, How to Sort of Be Happy in Law School. Um, you know, just prepping myself. I'm watching How I, or Who Killed Sarah. I'm on the last episode of the new season. So if you guys have not seen it and you like, like, true crime shows, you should definitely check it out. Duke! But yeah, I'm here with Dookie. He seems to be doing okay right now. So send prayers for him that he's okay. Huh, baby boy. But yeah, I've just been hanging out. And yeah, it's about 4.15. It is getting kind of cloudy because I was going to go sit outside with Duke and like read my book. Um, but it was kind of cloudy and he was getting a little bit overheated. Um, so brought him inside. But yeah, that's about it. Um, oh, I look scary and I need to, I don't know, start doing my makeup every day. But yeah, also I'm cutting my hair off tomorrow, guys. So I might vlog tomorrow too or throw in a clip into the end of this vlog of getting my hair cut so this is what my hair looks like now and I am planning to chop it to like above my shoulder so it's gonna be probably a drastic difference so I'm so excited just to refresh for the summer just do something fun you know and yeah so that's all I have to update you guys right now so I'll probably update you guys when Connor gets off work in about 45 minutes he gets off at five and we'll see what we get into tonight um but yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and keep monitoring Duke because he seems to be very overheated. He just has like his tongue hanging out. So, all right, I'll catch up with you guys later. Hello guys, it is the next day and I do have you propped up on my makeup. So you're seeing like the makeup, but I cut my hair guys. I'm sure you guys noticed because I'm combining this with the vlog from yesterday and my hair was long and then now it's like short, so. Hair is gone, hair is chopped. Um, I love it. I think it's so cute. It's so fun and like <laughs> bouncy. Um, and yeah, I really, really like it. So I just wanted to pop this clip in here and kind of do an ending because I'm going to edit the video and realize I never updated you guys, showed my hair or did an ending. So it was perfect time. But yeah, so this is my hair. This is going to be my summer hair. This is going to be the hair you guys see for probably the rest of the summer but yeah i'm really excited to start filming for you guys i'm gonna do a sit down video probably in the next couple days like um a like uh tips for college freshmen from a recently graduated college student um just to share some of my advice for in incoming freshmen because college can be so overwhelming and so like such a big change so i just feel like i could share a lot of my wisdom with some of you guys if you guys are interested and yeah, so I just wanted to end the vlog. Um, got Duke in here. I was just laughing because he just drug in a huge weed. Um, so yeah, that is interesting. Very interesting. But yeah, also update. He is doing okay from the whole onion incident yesterday. He is doing great. So that's really good. Really excited about that. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed today's vlog. If you did, make sure to give it a thumbs up. It helps me out so much. And don't forget to subscribe before you leave if you want to see more content from me. And I'll see you guys all in the next video. I love you guys. Bye. All right, guys. Also, really quickly, I forgot to show you. I wanted to show you guys the things that I got at Ulta. Um, just three quick products to help with the new short hair. Just because my hair is naturally on the thin side, um, I wanted to pick up a texturizing spray. That is Duke chewing on a towel in the background. Um, so I'll show you guys what I got. So I just picked up this little baby. This is the Not Your Mother's Plump for Joy Thickening Hair Lifter. Um, so I thought this would be good, especially since like I'm going to Florida next week, just to like pop in my travel stuff. It's small, it doesn't really take up a lot of space. Um, but it's the perfect hair pick-me-up lightweight formula. It's made with thickening, palmers, 
to create beautiful body with an added touch of softness and shine. So I'm, you just like kind of spray this into dry hair, wet hair, like whatever you want to do. And then I picked up this Kinra dry texture spray. Um, I know Kinra products are really good. My mom uses a lot of Kinra products. And then the lady that cut my hair um, was using a lot of Kinra products and so that they're pretty good. Um, so this is just a texture spray and increases texture and fullness in the hair. So I just kind of like spray this and like scrunch it up and it kind of makes your hair look fuller than it actually is. Um, yeah, and then I just picked up this little curling iron. This is just a super small barrel. This is um, a lot easier for shorter hair to get those tight curls and like the loose waves. So this was just from Bedhead. It was like 20 bucks. Um, so picked that up so that I can do curls. I'm obviously going to have to experiment. You know, I'm, I've had long hair for a while now, so it's going to be different to like figure out how to curl the short hair. Um, so, but hopefully this will be helpful um, and I can figure out how to do it. But yeah, so those are the products that I got for my short hair. I'm super excited to try out new hairstyles and just experiment with the short hair. So I'm definitely going to um, maybe include some like hair tutorials or like me trying hair like styles off of TikTok or something. I think that would be fun. So yeah, I'm very excited. Um, it was a great refresh, refresh that I feel like I needed. So yeah, I'm really excited and yeah. All right, I'll talk to you guys later.